my name is Ove Bosch and we're here at the Warwick booth at the 2014 NAMM show. We have some very exciting news for you this year and I'll show you around on the booth a little bit to show you what's new and what you have to check out. So first of all, we have the brand new WCA 2x10 cabinet which works perfectly of course with the LWA 1000. It's a 2x10 cabinet, normal weight, not lightweight, from the LW, uh, no, from the WCA series. The LWA 1000 was presented last year, so that's no news for this year. New is that it's going to be uh, delivered with a foot switch, so you can plug your instrument into the foot switch and use, use both channels as you like. Use one instrument with two different sound settings or whatever you like. Brand new we have these lightweight cabinets here. We have different sizes. We have a 2x8 cabinet. We have a 4x8 cabinet. We have a 1x12 cabinet and we have a 1x15 cabinet. You can choose either equipped with Warwick speakers or with Celestians. They're absolutely lightweight and they match perfectly with the LWA 1000. So that's a perfect lightweight rig for using in every situation. With two of these cabinets, they can handle the 1000 watts from the LWA. Absolutely effortless. So next thing is over here. As you can see, we have some beautiful custom shop instruments on our booth. And a very special, a very special one is this one here, which is a one of a kind instrument made for Peter Baltus, the bass player from Accept, and it's uh, layered with a metal lacquer, so it's uh, absolutely astonishing. The look is absolutely astonishing. We have these, we call it double stack Bixby but it's only for the look. <laughs> Equipped with EMG, pickups PJ, based on the Streamer LX, no, on the uh, Streamer CV, sorry. And next to it, we have the 2014 Limited Edition. These bases are uh, based on the Fortress model, which is discontinued, and so we decided to uh, make the 2014 Limited Series on that basis. These bases come with a swamp ash body, popular pearl top, wangy neck, bird's eye maple fingerboard, North Strand fat stack pickups, MEC electronics, of course the Warwick hardware, the Warwick inv invisible fret technology, and everything you know from the German Warwick bases. It's available in five or four strings, and it's limited to 100 pieces in total. Next thing, what brand new we have over there, follow me. Here we have the Bootsy Collins Artist Series Base, based on the space base Bootsy got two years ago from Warwick. This is a Chinese model based on, as I said, on his uh, signature model. And uh, that's a very unique base, as you can see. It's available in this nice purple color, equipped with EMC, with MEC uh, pickups, MEC electronics, Warwick hardware, as usual. So this is a brand new thing for this year, for all the funksters and all the hipsters. What you see here is the BC-10 combo that was presented last year but this year as an extension to the combo line of Warwick amplification we have it now deliverable to all the dealers, all the distributors so this is a very nice little combo amp 10 watts, 3 band equalizer can be used with two instruments aux in, headphones out so everything you need for practicing at home. 
from the Framus brand, we have brand new this year the Idolmaker series. You see here first the Idolmaker 5R, made of alder, with a, a triple A flame maple top, with a North Strand pickups. Right next to it, you see the Idolmaker, made with a mahogany body, also with a flame maple top. Over here you see the spectacular Idolmaker Stevie Sellers signature. Some more features like a kill pot, like a five-way switch here. This guitar over here is a very spectacular new model we present at the NAM. Last year we did the Wolf Hoffman Signature Series guitar. And this year we're doing the Wolf Hoffman Artist Series guitar. And we reverse the process of making guitars. Because normally guitars were produced like uh, the woodwork was done in China and the assembly was, is done in Germany or the US or whatever. Uh, as the wood, the tone wood, is the soul of every instrument, we turn this process around. The woodworks, the wood selection, the wood drying, and all the, the works with the frets and with everything that has to do with the woods happens in Germany, in Mark Neukirchen, Germany, at the Warwick and Framus headquarters. Then this guitar is being shipped to China and assembled with EMG pickups, a Floyd Rose license, tremolo, MEC electronics. They do also the lacquering. First they do the sanding, they do the lacquering in China, and then the instrument come back. Uh, that means this guitar is much more affordable than uh, a completely German-made instrument. But we have the quality of a German-made instrument because of all the woodwork is done from our craftsmen in Mark Neukirchen. So that's it with the spectacular news from Warwick and Framus on the 2014 NAM show. I want to invite you to come by, say hello, and check all the instruments and the new cabinets out.